You may hear the rain falling off the trees behind me. Just been that kind of morning. Started out a little sunny. Then I decided to go out on the trails. Haven't been out for a while. And lo and behold, started to rain quite hard. Now it's pretty much stopped. And uh, the sun's actually peeking out. Uh, this is a typical Pacific Northwest uh, March. Uh, we've had uh, more rain this year than... Uh, probably uh, the last decade. So in any case, uh, out here on the trails, it's always pleasant uh, getting ready for uh, spring. Uh, so close yet so far. Uh, can't stand any more rain. Want to get some sun. And boy, as soon as the sun pops out, it gets kind of warm. Pretty much everything's in full bloom. Uh, trees are budding. Uh, flowers have been out for quite a while, uh, six weeks in some cases. Uh, in the January, beginning of February, we had the crocuses and daffodils out. And I'm gonna quickly pan around. I'm heading up a nice wet trail, and hopefully that's where we're heading. So let's go. This video today is going to be a quick one, just to get a feel for the trails again. Uh, cabin fever set in, and it's always nice to get out in the quiet and peace, even with the rain. It adds to it. That big orange ball up in the sky is really welcome this morning. Sure makes a difference when you're out on the trails. Just brightens everything up. Good morning out there. It's Joe with Joe's Adventures. The sunshine is so welcome today. Just kind of makes you want to get out and do anything and everything. What I decided to do today and enjoy that sunrise. And next, did a little painting. Now, I'm out in the trails. It's uh, just after two o'clock and the sun is up high. Wow, what a gorgeous morning. Makes you want to get going. Get some enthusiasm. With all the rain that we've had, all these streams and brooks are running rapidly. And I'm just crossing this footbridge right now, moving up the trail. It's just a gorgeous, beautiful day. The sun is so bright. Wow. Take advantage of every minute of it. All right, here we go, heading on up. I've got the sun directly behind me, so I'm going to change the angle on my camera as I head up. And uh, this is where it gets a little steeper. There's so many things I want to do today. I sure want to make uh, time to get out in the garden a little bit uh, with the wet winter we've had, a little bit uh, delayed in getting things planted. So, still gaining some altitude. And here we go, a little more up and up as we travel. Seems like that first mile is always the most difficult. It's a lot easier now. Uh, well, I just reached another switchback. And uh, we're gonna continue going up. Well, I've just come from up there, and I'm on my way back down now. And it's been a wonderful morning. I'm gonna have to cut it a little short, shorter than I wanted to anyway. And I was looking for some uh, trillium blooming out here in the woods, but the none, none blooming yet, couldn't find any.
It's so quiet out here in the woods. All you hear is the water gushing down the streams. It's been a really brisk walk today, a little over four miles, and uh, better than walking six or seven down in the flatlands. Good workout. Well, today it's been up, up, and up some more, but it's been a great morning, perfect day. Good getting out on the trails today and having a little time to paint and my next stop is the garden. So as you can tell, I've been doing a lot of altitude gain here. And uh, I'm gonna sign off for now. This is Joe with Joe's Adventures. Have a wonderful spring and a great St. Patrick's Day. See you soon.